This video is sponsored by Supercell's Brawl Stars. Yo everyone, Sword Tour 6 here today. Welcome back to a brand new video or review. And today we are reviewing to a game called called Brawl Stars by Supercell. What the heck is this? Yes, today we're gonna be reviewing to the game called Supercell Supercell's Brawl Stars. If you guys have not heard of it, then check it in the link in the description below because this game has been out for almost two weeks and the game is actually really awesome. Now this okay now what you can do here this is Trophy Road. Once you start, you can start with you start off with a uh, a chest. Start you start off with a with a uh, chest. I think you go you then you go on unlocking new characters like Nita. Uh, you get you get to you, you unlock new events like Showdown. You unlock Colt. You unlock you you unlock tokens and all that. I'll show you guys it once we get started. You also can you also can earn free stuff in the shop, and this is a new brawler pen. Very nice, very nice. The castle for Nika, nice, nice. We get a the Cochette's costume and and a new and a, and a new brawler. Now here in the shop, you can, you can find offers and also find new uh, free chests, as you can find here. We we got six tokens for Shelly. We got eight tokens for Poco. Which is the mariachi, I would like to say. All right, so I'll show you guys some gameplay. But for this one, this this one is the character Shelly. But this is but you have different skins of Shelly. You have the you have the regular the fighter Shelly. Then you have the bandita Shelly, which looks actually really awesome. And then you have the star Shelly with a new costume and a new, and a customizable gun. You know, you can unlock new characters by by going through the trophy road or by buying them. As we have, and as we have here, we have Nita, the pen, the panda fighter, or the fighter, and we have Panda Nita, and then we have the Reynolds Nita. Okay, now with the full, now with the bear in the background, can, this character can summon can summon a bear to fight alongside with her and defeat other enemies. Um, we have Colt next time. We have the sharpshooter Colt. Then we have the Rockstar Colt, and we do not and we do not know what this skin is, but we'll find out soon. But Colt is actually like the main character of the game, almost. But you start off with Shelly, and then we have the healer Poco. He can also fly by playing tones on his guitar, but he can also heal his teammates, which is Shelly or Poco. I was sure you guys what funny by healing. In a sec, and we're going to do all these. All right, so we have the gym. So you guys have gym grab, which we have a new event, which is the ice block rock, and then you have showdown, feast or fun mine. Oh, First, we're going to show the the first. We're going to show you the the gym grab event because you know. All right, all right. So we're going to show you some gameplay of gem grab and we'll see you guys what I mean by Poco's. We're, we're, I'm going to show you Poco's abilities, Poco's abilities, and and his attacks. As you guys, as you guys see here, we have Colt in the middle, we have Shelly on the left, and we have Poco on the right. All right. So in gem grab, what you want, what you do is you attack the other players so you can get a hold of the gems that are popping up in the middle. He also wants to defend as well. All right, so shooting, you shoot with this, aiming it, or you can just double tap, or you can just like tap so you can kill the other players. And you'll, you'll automatically heal for being for, without being in battle for for moments. Now the yellow one that shines up is your supercharge move. You, the, you, yeah. the move that gets gets charged up once you once you like shoot enough times or get hit enough times. And once you get killed, you can respawn like I just did. Now and the 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 point of this game is trying to get the hold of ten gems till the end till the end. And once you get ten gems, it'll start it'll start counting down. 
and if you lose 10 gems well then you start you then you start to the number you have less like for example nine if you have 10 gems or no if you have if you have 12 gems and then you lose two and then you lose like for say three more the countdown will stop and you will have to recover 10 gems back so you so you can so you can so the countdown can begin and so the countdown can begin and so and so you can win the match and once you finish with the match you get you get the results with the with the ranks and it also start tokens you get experience points by winning and, and it also you can be marked a star player if you do the much damage or the most experienced player of the team you also get experience by that and for victory you also get to tokens which ranks up to a total of 100 which brings it to the total amount and also since we have to the multiplier of of two it will double the, the amount of tokens you can either play again or you can exit if you choose play again it will show a green mark on your icon and, uh, and if they want to play again with the same team you'll, you'll move on with the same team but if you don't want to then show it an x and just press x all right so now you know a little bit much about poco I will show. Oh, okay, that was, I will show much of the characters as like Poco, Shelly, and Nita, and also Colt. I forgot. I'm saying Colt. I went back out. All right. So now that you've seen much of, of Poco, so now you've seen much of Poco's style or fight fighter skills. Uh, we're going to. Or first, we're going to upgrade Colt. And then we're going to use him. Now we're going to use him add again in gym in gym grab, it's just so we can we can uh, you know show much of his skills. And once the match starts, it will so we'll start matching up. I, I will have to say this though, I'm not much of a character of Colt. I just like, I mean, I like the character, but it's just like. The, the range of fire of fire it's the range of fire i don't i'm not a very big fan of it hello oh shoot oh shit i didn't notice him Alright, we have like six, no eight, we have eight. Yo, get out here, get out here. Alright, we got ten gems. We're good to go. Oh, also, I forgot to mention the bars that are that are on the bottom, are, that are on the bottom of the health. That's your ammo. You run out of ammo. It will try to look your character. Your character will try to reload quickly until you can fire the next time. As you guys see, we got we got victory, and also and also by every victory, you also get get trophies for that character. You don't get trophy, trophies for for all of your characters. You just get tro trophies for a certain character, and once you have enough a number of amount of trophies, you'll get ranked up. All right, so we're gonna show you the fighter Nita. And this one, I have no trouble. Of, I have to say, I have like no trouble with that. Her. Her weapon is mostly about dynamites and all that, and so I'm not very much of a fan of dynamites. And we have and we have team of Nita, which is not, kind of not good, I'd say. I really don't know much of of Nita's skills and attacks. Well, all I do know is that she can summon a pair.
Alright, we just summoned a bear and it is gonna help us defend and attack with us. So you not already know much of her attacks and skills. As you guys can see, I have to not use Nita very much. I have to not use her very much. Alright, I will obviously her her weapons and all that. Um no, 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 info, no, no info about it. But anyway, here's Shelly. You start off with the regular Shelly, the bandit. I was like, oh, she looks like a bandit, I'd say, or like a wild, a wild west version of Shelly. So you start off with this character, and then you know, then you have Bandita Shelly, which is mostly like a cowgirl Shelly, almost with except for the eye patch. And then for Star Shelly, you actually unlock her once she's like start playing. So as in like, you first start playing as Shelly, and in fact for like in, after like a round or two, you unlock Star Shelly, which is a, which I'm I'm actually, well let's say that I've been using her much as at least because like, her, you know, you know, it's like it's like I like this like, I don't know how can I phrase this like, like this like this is the character that I'm very much fond with until i i at least unlock a character which i'm very useful at well not i don't want to say useful like i'm really good at i won't say but we're going to be doing showdown and for this one it, it's almost like fortnite but except for like squads you have solo and duo first i'm going to show you solo you know, i'm not gonna brag but solo it's actually really cool well i'm mostly i'm i'm mostly better with with solo but i'm not gonna with that we're gonna my character oh jeez okay never mind I actually um, over bragged myself. Okay, also I forgot, I forgot to mention if you lose a match, you lo also lose trophies, which you do not want to do. We're gonna start again with solo again, because um, well, let's just say that I've that it's been like almost a week or two since I stopped playing this game for a while. No, I mean, I still have it game on my phone. I just didn't, you know, I just didn't play much. As I did once the game got out. I have Poco coming out. And now we're left side screen. Which is now out. Oh, I forgot to mention. On the, right there on the right side of, my, of the screen. You have gas. Which is almost like the storm in Fortnite. Or... Some kind of disease in PUBG, but but it's mostly gas. Well, it's the finest gas. So okay, what's that character? I don't know who that character is. But I was gonna say this: this character throws like poisonous gas everywhere. Hello, Star Shelly. Yeah, and I died again. Okay. What has happened to me for the past few weeks? What happened to me? Let's just try again this time and make sure let's do better. Better than the last two tries. Oh, there's the poison gas. It's just started. So, like, if you like, almost like a minute till this game, till the match goes on, you start the gas starts from around. Did we kill each other? No, we did not. I don't know what happened to me. I just went from good to bad. 
I even went from good to bad. I don't know what's going on with me. All right, where's the show? Where? Okay, we're gonna do this one time, and then we're going to and then we're gonna show some gameplay with a duo, duo version of this of this of this game mode. Oh, that's good. I don't know. I'm not really sure if you can stack up with the special shot. I'm not sure. Ooh. What you want to do is actually is to save like ammo when you're doing a match because once you need one, because when you need ammo the most, you just get destroyed. Oh, that's close. Come on. Oh, that's good. All right, we're back in the games, boys. We're back in the game. We're back. Oh, I also forgot to mention, in these game modes, you can actually play by yourself with, with CPUs. And also, I forgot to mention that again as well. The more tokens you grab, the more damage you do. And one. All right. So it's mostly like Battle Royale style, but it's much different with besides by like 100 competitors, you have fit, you have 10 competitors. All right, now we'll show you the duo, the duo side of this game, or of this game mode. And we have enough to to upgrade Shelly and Coco. All right. Oh, so I forgot. I keep mentioning stuff. You can also get bonuses like gems and coins. Oh, wait, that. All right, so we'll so be we'll pay these guys. All right, all right, we're gonna be right. Yes, we're good. Okay, we're good. Now, let's do the duo over this. All right, so you create, okay, so as Battle Royale style in PUBG, you get paired up with a random player. You get paired up with a random player unless a you and your friend want to play on the same match. And actually, you got, it's also like Fortnite as well, but was well, yeah, I was gonna say this is same as Fortnite. I right, should have my friend up here. Oh. Oh, she, okay. This, he or her has Nita. All right. Yeah, I'm not sure if gym collecting does the same effect as you and your teammates. I'm not really sure. Yes, it does. Okay. No, no. Our pin is on the move against this guy. Okay. Right. We have 11, which means that we're stronger than ever. And collecting these, these types of tokens increase your HP and your attack. So it's good to... To destroy enemies and and kill them, and our partner got them. Wow! Right, nice, dark, nice. All right, we'll go in with another player. Stop. All right, so you basically basically know what you, what to expect in this game. You basically know what to expect, son. So you're you're good. And we have Muchi, which is playing as Colt. Yes, if that's okay. Ooh. Oh. Mm. 
Oh. Oh, that was good. Right, we got we got pandas around here everywhere. Oh, I forgot to mention. I keep mentioning things. Oh, that one was crazy. Okay, I've, I keep for, I keep forgetting to mention things. Okay, besides like teammates dying on you, if your teammate dies, you basically you basically get get to respawn. Your teammate basically gets to respawn once you if you're still alive. So if you're still alive, your teammate responds and you get back up, no problem. Okay, better not die. You better not die. Okay, so I'm I'm going back in in two seconds, and my team is still alive. So if your team is still alive and you die, you get a chance to respawn. If your teammate is dead, and if your, if your teammate dies, and then secondly like you're you, you're dead or you get killed, then you don't respawn and you lose the match. As you can see, I'm running low on health, so you want you might want to back away in the fight so you can recover health and what we want. All right, so that's my. All right, so that's all I. That's all we what there is to do. But there's still new events. But you need to collect trophies to unlock the event. As for the daily events, you have to uh, you have to reach to a total amount of 150 trophies to unlock this the daily events. If you want to unlock special events, you need to collect a total of 800 trophies to unlock. And, and it's gonna take like a week or so. Depending, depending how much you play this game and when oftenly, then you might unlock it like a week or so. But if you're not a, but if you're not that, if, but if you're that type of guy that does not play much in this game, like you like play this occasionally or every day, well then, you know, it take you like at least like two weeks or so. I don't know, but yeah. But time to share my thoughts about this game and all that since it's been out for almost two weeks now. Since Monday was the release date of this game, um, my thoughts in about this, like, I mean, this game is is like it. This game is is created by the games who created Clash of Clans and all that. But again, the the, the Supercell actually did did a great job in, in doing like the whole bunch of like remodel. Like, I can't speak to I can't speak while doing this. Looks like for example. Um, okay, so like for example, the battle royale style, um, Clash of Clans battle royale, um, and that you have guards which which can summon knights, knights or knights barbarians or whatever. You have those kinds of decks. In this game, it ha mo it, it kind of has that spectrum where it can where you can upgrade the cards, where it can upgrade your cards, so you can. Get more more health hard points, so your so your characters your warriors can get more health hard points. Now in this case, you also get more hard points. You also get more hit points, and your attack increases. But what they don't have in battle in Clash of Clans battle battle royale is that you don't have the customizable skins. As as for example, this game has each character in this game has three has three game three. Three skins. Kayate has three skins, and so, and so instead of having like a plain old skin, I died. A plain old skin, you get you get three skins for a price of one character, and I feel like that's really good, like a really good deal with all characters having three skins and all that. So, yeah, but this game, this game is actually really competitive. You can see here, I'm getting my butt beat down. We have some gems, which is really nice. And my butts can be down in this game is a it's a type of game which is really competitive. And so I really do I would recommend this to to gamers who are really competitive in games and all that. So I would really recommend this game to both to those types of gamers. I'm sorry if you wouldn't if you couldn't um re, uh hear me, I'm sorry. But you know all 
all information and so and so on and so forth but yeah but this game is real competitive and those types of gamers who are real compet or who like competitive games well i will recommend this game because not, not although this game you have competitive players playing all around the world but it's really fun and you also can you, you can also play this game with your friends and i'm gonna show you if, if i didn't share this with you in the beginning of the game in the beginning of the video um you have a menu which is almost like fortnite fortnite but but you'll have like three slots but you only have like two slots for to my friends not three and so what they did with the resemblance with pubg and, and fortnite is that you they said they made it to a to a non-stop action game as like for fortnite battle royale and all that they they made this type of game which is which is relatable to Fortnite and all and all those battle royale games, which is actually really cool. Nice. Oh, damn it! Wait, now this game, now this match game competitive now. Look at that. Alright, we lost the fish. Alright. So that's more basically my thoughts of this game. This game is actually really competitive, which you don't want to stop playing. And also, as as I'm as now I'm mentioning this, if you have slots for adding friends and all that, and you also can invite friends by like sharing your friend codes and that. I don't know, I don't know, but you also can make a friendly match where you can invite friends, so you guys don't have to like go randomly with other players, which is actually really cool. And so, yes, but anyway, this game is actually cool that I, like, once this game came out, I was, I didn't want to stop playing this game. It was actually really addictive. It was cool. It was like Fortnite, it was PUBG, name it, you name it. But yes, I, re I recommend this game to competitive gamers who like competitive games, like, for example, for this one. I, I would recommend this game for all of you guys. No pressure. Well, I don't know why I said no pressure, but um, yes. But overall, this game, I'll give it a 9 out of 10 of productivity, 9 out of, 9 out of 10 of gameplay, and 10 out of 10 of customized, customizable characters. But yes, I'll, uh, if you guys want to try this game out for yourselves, I'll leave, I'll leave a link in the description down below for Apple's, for Apple, for Apple phones and Android phones. Um, yeah, so if you guys want to try this out, links in the description. And... Well, if if I if you guys do 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 see me out in the battlefield in this game, well then I wish you guys the best of luck against me. Yeah, but I, but overall my, my performance on this game is actually above average. So don't expect don't expect me to go easy on you. So yeah, but that's if you if you see me out in the battlefield. So but um and that'll be it for today for today's review if you guys did enjoy make sure press the like button subscribe if you have not yet and push the notification bell down below to get some a single video and well next time i will try to find something to do as like i mean i would do I'll, i could try to do something about videos about all the games um uh, i have a video i actually have the video back in november or october yes back in november I think it's back in November or December. Back in a few weeks or in November, I don't remember. But one more Um, but I still have to edit that video and have to upload it still. Um, we still have, we still have more gameplay of Dragalia to do. I have not continued from the spot where I left off yet, but we'll get there. We'll we'll get moving on to the series of Dragalia, and we'll do some more Grand Chase. After I've finished editing the video and all that, so but anyway, that'll be it for today's video. If you guys really did enjoy, make sure to like button, subscribe if you haven't yet, and push on to the bell button to get some single video. No, anyway, that'll be it. I'll see you guys in the next one. In the next one, it's Friday Six. Signing out. Peace, everybody.